What's going on guys, it's Stolze here, bringing you guys another video. In today's video, we're gonna be looking at the Stream Elements merch store that's currently in the beta phase right now. We're gonna be looking at what kind of products you get with it, the quality of the prints. I'm gonna be giving you my overall feedback that I had with the store. So sit back and hope you enjoy. So first off, you get a coffee mug. You can see here, just have a nice little mug. Great color on this. Um, if I were to buy a mug from anywhere, I'd expect this to be looking just like this. It's got good color, uh, pretty standard for a mug. Nothing really to uh, be expecting there that's out of the ordinary. Next, we get a mouse pad here. Um, I didn't really look at the size of the mouse pad and I just figured it was going to be a bigger one. Um, I was kind of disappointed in that because it's so small. Um, I can't really game on this. It's a little bit smaller than what I'm used to for, for gaming. So I just use it on my iMac over here for editing because I don't really need to move my mouse that much over there. I do think that they are going to be getting some bigger mouse pads soon in the near future, which will be nice because I don't think anyone really wants to buy a mouse pad that is only about eight by 10 inches. So hopefully they get that soon. We have my sticker. I don't know if you can see it over here on my uh, computer, but if not, I will show a little clip of it on screen. Um, overall, the quality of the sticker was pretty nice. The color was very vibrant. Nothing to complain about there, just a kiss cut sticker. I think the mouse pad and the sticker, they all came from overseas, I think, in China. The t-shirt and sweatshirt came from the US somewhere. I forget where it was. I'm not really sure, I can't recall right now. Let's take a look at the t-shirt here. So here's your t-shirt. It's made by, um, it's a canvas brand. Um, pretty soft, I like the feel of it. As you can see in here, the overall print quality is kind of washed out. Honestly, I wasn't overly happy with it. I did email them. They answered me right back right away. I think they're going to be doing some reprints for me. If you can see on the video, I mean, this isn't really the red of my logo. I mean, you can see how different that is. So I really wasn't happy with that. Overall, the t-shirt quality is nice. So there's nothing to complain about there. I just wish that the screen print was a little bit brighter, uh, more vivid red like my logo is. Honestly, I wouldn't recommend my viewers to even go buy this merch uh, because it's not really a good representation of my logo or my brand. Next, let's look at the sweatshirt. So I got white sweatshirt because I have red. I thought it would just be cool to have a nice red sweatshirt. Um, I don't know if you can see the quality on this sweatshirt either, but it is actually worse than the t-shirt. <laughs> It's really washed out. I haven't washed this yet at all. This is right out of the box. It looks like it's been sitting in the sun for maybe, I don't know, 15 days. <laughs> I mean, this is really washed out. The red, the whites almost look like it has a yellow tint over it. Just overall not happy. The blacks, the black isn't even, or it's actually navy in there. It's, it's like washed out. You can't even tell it's navy. It almost looks like a, a brown. I don't know how they do the printing. Um, I'd rather just have like a, a vinyl print over it, honestly. Um, I'm not really sure how the merch printing goes or what the process was there. This looks like just a screen print. I don't know how well you guys can see that here, but. Yeah, so we'll see what they um, plan to do with my request that I put in with them. They were emailing me back and forth. I sent them pictures of it until then. I will keep you guys updated. And once I receive those, you can check them out. I'll probably post them on my Twitter. All right guys, so after looking at the quality of the products you get, I'd recommend the Stream Elements merch if you're an upcoming streamer or a small streamer like myself. It's a very really easy way to get your merch out there, get your name out there if 
any loyal viewers that you do have or do come in want to support you, it's a good option for them. I'm just going to wait until I get the answer back from Stream Elements to see if they reprint me something and if the prints are better. Um, I would definitely consider it 100% after that. Hopefully you'll also be able to customize your logo more and the placements on the shirts. I know right now there's not really much option. You just load your logo on and it pops onto the shirt and you really don't have any other customization abilities with the clothing or products. It'd be nice if they could get maybe some sleeve things. You can make it smaller to go just like on the little like pocket area. That'd be kind of cool. Uh, maybe stuff on the back as well until that comes up. That'll be awesome to have that. I think Stream Elements merch store would be the way to go. I know Streamlabs, you have to pay for the Prime right now to get more products. There's only a certain number of products you can use in the free version. Overall, the quality besides the print on the sweatshirt, t-shirt, uh, mouse pad, and uh, sticker in the mug, um, everything's really good. The sweatshirt's really comfortable. I put that on. Uh, it was nice and cozy inside. The t-shirt was nice and soft. I do think the sizes run a little bit small. Um, usually I wear a large, but the sweatshirt was kind of snug on me. I was almost going to give it to my fiance instead and be like, here, wear my logo and kind of looked at me funny. Like, I'm not going to wear your merch. This t-shirt as well uh, seemed to be a little bit snug on me as well. I normally wear a large. Um, so I don't know, maybe something to consider there is maybe going a size up or if you do start it, tell everyone in your, you know, Twitch chat or YouTube videos, wherever they're getting your merch from or watching your content, let them know that you might want to go a size up. I also think the Stream Elements merch store is a good option too because they have some of the best um, percentages for you to make some money to help support your stream or your YouTube content as well. Um, I know it beats out Streamlabs by a little bit. I don't know the exact number on what it is, but I know the margin is more on Stream Elements. So that can help you a little bit more as well. I didn't mention when I was purchasing the bundle, um, you do have to pay shipping. I'm not sure what it was for me. I think it was around like 10 or $15. Like I said, the stuff came separate. So the clothes came in one package and then the cup, mouse pad, and sticker came in another. They came relatively quickly. I don't think I had to wait too long. I saw another review saying that they waited quite a bit for it to come, but I think he was in Australia, so that may be a different factor because I'm in the US. Overall, it didn't really take too long. I wasn't really disappointed in it. I got notifications when my stuff was on the way. Right now, if I were to give Stream Elements uh, a percentage grade on their store, I would probably give them maybe like, uh, say like a 78%. I'll see when I hopefully get some new printed merch back, um, the clothing that I need redone. Um, hopefully that can bump that score up to like a 90%. And then once they get all those features implemented to utilize more customization with the merch, your logos and designs, you can maybe add some more designs because right now you can only use that one design on your clothing and products you can't load multiple designs in at all so you're stuck to that one right now so once they get more of those features in i think this could be a 100 percent store for me grading wise um, i wouldn't see why not thanks for watching guys don't forget to hit that like button that subscribe button and if you want any questions or any feedback, pop into my Twitch every Tuesday, Thursday, 6.30 p.m. Central, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks. Have a good one. Ha <laughs> ha!